The airwaves are filled with political ads these days, with Republican gubernatorial candidates trying to stand out from the rest while still appealing to their base. And some of those ads are grabbing some attention. But are they accurate? We put candidate Kevin Rinke's ad through the Local 4 Trust Index. Why is it that dead people always vote Democrat? A statement of fact masquerading as a question and one that has been proven not to be true. Most recently by the Michigan Auditor General's report in March of this year. That report found more than 1,600 cases of dead people casting a ballot in 2020. But the majority of those were people who voted absentee and died before Election Day. Other cases were shown to be accidental because the dead voter had a very similar name to someone alive, likely a relative. Oh, and when dead people vote, they do sometimes vote Republican. A quick search can turn up cases from all over the country. I'll audit the voting rolls to ensure all voters are registered, identified, and alive. Yeah. And I'll create an election integrity unit to investigate any hint of cheating. Be careful with this campaign promise, which again tries to fan the flames of the lie that the 2020 election was stolen from Donald Trump. Elections in several states were audited, some by Republicans, and were found not to be fraudulent. In Michigan, more than 250 audits were conducted around the state, debunking the claim that dead people decided the election. In fact, the state reported right after the election that nearly 3,500 ballots were rejected because clerks learned the voter had indeed died. And even if none of those discrepancies had been caught, it wouldn't have mattered because Joe Biden won Michigan by more than 150,000 votes. Sorry, bud. It's also worth noting that we've seen evidence that high profile Republicans do not believe there was widespread fraud in the 2020 election. Most recently through the January 6th committee hearings, we've heard several, including from former Attorney General Bill Barr, acknowledge no evidence the election was stolen.